Fall is in the air, as you can see, and winter is coming. So if you like powder up to your knees, skiing out of bounds and through the trees while it's snowing, then you're definitely a free rider, and picking the right ski is essential. With a rocker profile, the contact of the ski with the snow is situated closer to the binding, which is in the middle of the ski. You can also have rocker in the tail, following the same principles, which is called twin rocker. Tip rocker is very important on a free ride ski, as it allows flotation and powder while absorbing bumps and uneven terrain. Tail rocker makes controlling the ski easier and adds maneuverability. The waist width of a ski is situated at the binding. Freeride skis have the widest width of all alpine ski ranges, and there are three types which are all differentiated by their width. These skis have a waist width of 90 to 100 mil. They have significant rocker at the tip, but not as much at the tail. These freeride skis are the most versatile as they can be skied in all types of conditions. Bumps, forest, tight couloirs, and are great for everything. <laughs> These skis have a waist width of 100 to 110 and are clearly geared towards free ride and deep snow. They help you stay on top of the powder and have amazing flotation. With a waist width of over 110, these are known as fat skis and are ideal for big pow days that all free skiers impatiently wait for. Free touring is a mix between ski touring and free ride. The free touring range is for the people who don't mind using skins to hike up. Also known as free rando, these skis have a waist width of 95 to 105 with some tip rocker. They are usually a lighter version of a free ride ski for skiing hard in the descent. Generally, in order to find your length of your free ride skis, you need to add five to 10 centimeters to your height. If you're an advanced skier and like making big turns in wide open spaces, then you can probably add up to 15 centimeters in height. For free touring, choosing a ski that is five centimeters smaller than you will allow you to have a lighter and more maneuverable ski for the climbs and the descent. Don't go off piece without the essential equipment trio, shovel, probe, transceiver, and of course, know how to use them. Hope you enjoyed the episode and make sure to follow us on our Solomon channels. <laughs>